Welcome to the overview on Response to Intervention Framework in Math. Response to Intervention, or RTI, is a multi-tiered early detection, prevention, and support system that identifies struggling students and assists them before they fall behind. RTI strategies are used in both reading and mathematics. RTI systems combine screening, progress monitoring, systematic instruction, and the use of data to differentiate instruction at each tier level with intensive interventions targeted at struggling students. The practice guide for RTI math offers important recommendations to help educators assess students' mathematics abilities and implement interventions within an RTI framework. Three RTI math practices have been identified that support the development of foundational arithmetic skills in elementary and middle school students. Let's take a closer look at these practices. RTI begins with universal screening for all students to identify those at risk for potential mathematics difficulties at the beginning and middle of the year. Screening is followed by close monitoring of students' progress. A district or school level RTI team should select screening measures that are efficient and reliable and demonstrate predictive validity. Using the same screening tool across a district enables analysis of results across schools. In grades 4 through 8, screening data can be used in combination with state testing results to assess mathematics skills. Regular progress monitoring is used in Tier 2, Tier 3, and in Tier 1 for borderline students. Monitoring should be conducted at least once a month using grade-appropriate general outcome measures. In addition, curriculum-embedded assessments can provide helpful information about student learning. Progress monitoring provides teachers with valuable information for regrouping students. Regrouping helps to respond to students' changing instructional needs and prevents them from stagnating in an intervention that is not working. RTI mathematics interventions teach the foundations of arithmetic as recommended in the 2008 National Mathematics Advisory Panel Report. Tier 2 and Tier 3 interventions should focus intensely on in-depth treatment of whole numbers in kindergarten through grade 5 and on rational numbers in grades 4 through 8. Also important is explicit instruction in solving word problems and building fluent retrieval of basic arithmetic facts. Instruction during Tier 2 and Tier 3 interventions is intentional. In RTI, teachers use explicit systematic instruction that includes modeling, scaffolded practice, corrective feedback, and cumulative review. Students need opportunities to work with concrete materials and visual representations of mathematical ideas, such as number lines, arrays, and strip diagrams. Teachers use concrete manipulatives first, followed by representations, with the goal of moving toward facility with the abstract. Because students struggling with mathematics have likely experienced failure and frustration by the time they are placed in an intervention, teachers should continually encourage active student engagement, remind students about the need for effort and persistence in learning mathematics, and acknowledge accomplishments and effort.